Now, remember, you're probably hitting right now 30%. Mm -hmm. What you need to do, you got to have 20 to 22 sentences, no doubt. Okay, but the most important thing, unique words need to account for 33%. Oh, I can't even do it. What the fuck am I doing? Oh, shit. Okay, is that it? Okay, yeah, whatever. It needs to account for 33%. You, in your last essay, you included only seven words from that introduction. Mm -hmm. I want to say that because I didn't take a photo, but this stupid ass website, like I said, these Koreans, they don't know what the fuck they do. Okay. <laughs> they, they wrote one unique word in their introduction. I recorded the video. I was doing it with the girl from Kazakhstan and I said, mother, mm -hmm. you wrote one word, the title, and they wrote two sentences. They gave themselves a five. The motherfuckers wrote a conclusion too. <laughs> I laughed. I said, you guys, you're so out of touch with reality. I'm never going <laughs> to response anymore. You motherfuckers are simpletons. Okay. So <laughs> what I need you to do, I'm just going to look at this introduction. Now, remember, I need you to go ratio two, three. Okay. Two, three ratio in terms of two reading sentences and three listening in regards to your body paragraphs. Okay. Now, again, I'm going to say it again. You got 280. I don't know if it's because mm -hmm. SA saved. Could be. <laughs> but you got a 20. You wrote 280, got a 23. Only one other mm -hmm. woman I know that got an unbelievably remarkable score. She wrote 23, uh, 200 and uh, what? She wrote 170 words and got a 23. Mm. Yeah. Small testing center and uh, testing center in Youngstown, Ohio. I said, oh. man, I think those guys wanted to hurry up and get home and have dinner, and they just. <laughs> <laughs> I'm fucking terrible, huh? Yeah, I know. <laughs> All right, no, it doesn't make sense. One seventy, one hundred mm -hmm. and twenty-three. This is not two thousand and ten. This is not mm -hmm. two thousand and five. You know, these Indians run the show. And they're going to gut you with all that money they can. Oh, money, money. Okay, so here we go. Let's get into this. Let's go dive into this. I'm talking shit. Let's go. All right. So what I do here, I don't know what this essay is. Ooh, nice. Never seen this one. All right. So here we go. Going green. So check this out. If I were to take notes, I got to get some unique words. Mm -hmm. I got to get some unique words and you got to be able to bullshit. It's not so much template. I don't know. I feel like sometimes with the software, they're just going to highlight the majority of your template and say, bye-bye. Now nah, we got to reduce that. So if we see this mm -hmm. going green, individual companies reduce their impact on the environment. That's not what it is. Normally I come right down here. Going green has mm -hmm. many benefits, not only for earth, but for individuals as well. So I know that the title is about going green, environmentally friendly uh, products. Uh, why? Well, I hurry up and scan here and I saw it. Okay. So going green environmentally friendly products and regulations. I have no idea. Now check this out. I'm going to write down a couple more words just so I hit that unique word count and then I can bullshit my way. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, let's see. Individual and companies reduce impact carbon footprint. There it is. Benefits. Now, I may not use all that, and I'm probably not going to write all those words, nor are you going to write all of them, because your integrated essay will come back onto the screen. Okay? So, I'm just writing this because, guess what? Remember, I told you you had seven unique words count, word count, right? When you do your mm -hmm. score, you're going to see your score shoot up. And you're going to be like, damn, instead of writing seven words, I wrote 15 unique words. And I kind of blew okay. my way, too. This is exactly all right. what I'm trying to do. Okay, so going back to what you had written down with your essay, or to hell with it, I'm just going to do this. Here we go. Let's see. Both the, is, is that how I started off? Both the reading and the mm -hmm. lecture are about going green, which is a way for individuals and companies to lessen their impact on the environment. Oh, you see how I kind of just bullshit my way? I'm just like, I'm okay. okay. Now I'm going to no. this. The author of the reading states 
that these, this is a big word, you're not going to write it, don't worry, entities, <laughs> okay, have begun, present perfect, using environmentally friendly products, and it has resulted in many benefits. Now, check this out. I forgot to write this. Here we go. Benefit environment. I forgot the two paragraphs. Here we go. Increase profits, save money. What? No. I forgot about him. I forgot about him right there. <laughs> is it? The audio's not even playing? Seems like the obvious thing to do. Yeah, it is. Why is it so low? <laughs> I swear something's up. I'm going to have to restart my computer or something. Oh my goodness gracious. So I'm going to have to log into another browser. Whatever. Okay. Goodbye, test fighter. It's my ass. All right. Here we go. Let's do it. Now, the reason why I hurry up and wrote down those last two, mm -hmm. the fact that uh, these last three things was because I want to give my internal summary. Okay. I can combine this into one sentence or I can make a new sentence. Now, remember, me and you, we're trying to get to that 20 sentence. Just make a new mm -hmm. sentence, right? And many benefits. In defense to his argument, he provided that it would be highly beneficial for the environment, increase profits for companies, and save money in the future. You see how I just added a whole mm -hmm. bunch of words that came to my mind? This is called unique words. You don't have God. to always focus on the specific individual mm -hmm. stuff like that. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. That's what I want you to do in terms of achieving that unique word count, okay? Okay. So the key is type of paraphrasing. Yeah. But using the, the words I already read. Uh -huh. Okay, okay. Because I try to change a little bit. You try changing it a little bit? Yeah. Like how? How do you try changing it? Like, for example, um, uh, if I read like individuals and companies, I put like ways for each one and for big um business something like that like change like paraphrasing but it's not the correct right i have to use it yeah yeah you could like i said if you see me i plucked out those words such as environmentally friendly products right uh -huh. individuals companies reduce impact carbon footprints benefits i got all those unique words from that paragraph mm -hmm. but then i just rephrased it in a way that they're not necessarily going to be able to see a template nor the words okay. either but also it is very important for you to add in the words like what i did look how i added in those. okay mm -hmm. it would be highly beneficial for the environment increase profits for companies and save money in the future that wasn't in there i created mm -hmm. those are unique words too okay got it okay unique words could also be the fact that you know uh having words that are like at least what is it mm -hmm. five not 25 percent um words that are like five letters or more right okay okay so this is what we're going to be doing from now on all right guys all right so 